Jeremy with Inline Performance Magazine. Just gonna discuss my uh, my uh, first day at the track. I was slow as dirt. <laughs> okay, I mean I was like molasses. I mean when I even got started, I was all over that track in Cebu. I mean I was everywhere. Um, I could not set up a line uh, to a corner for another corner. I was just doing whatever. Okay, and so of course you know later on when I asked the instructor you know for a little bit of advice, a little bit of help with it, um, they followed me. Definitely. Definitely helped me out a lot, actually. Um, my first session, I went out and uh, I was stuck behind a lot of Sigu guys who were actually new riders just in general. So, like, I was moving very slowly, okay? You know, by my second session, I just pulled in front of everybody, started past people, and just did my own thing. You know, after a couple of sessions, he bumped me up to B, and uh, I was just mid pack, you know, still completely lost and kind of intimidated too. Like, oh man, this is B, this is what I was doing in C. You know, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna suck in B, you know? And uh, throughout the day, you know, I actually just started, you know, improving. Like, this, each session got better and better. In fact, each lap just got better and better and better. And, um, you know, they gave me a lot of great advice. But the best advice that I got was, uh, it doesn't matter, you know, I asked them about, you know, those Pirelli tires that they're selling that are, uh, that are, you know, they were slicks. And, you know, when I, the best advice that he's given me was, it's all in your head. Towards my last couple of sessions, once I figured out, like, yeah, it's just in my head, you know, just go, you know, have fun and enjoy it, you know, my riding just improved to a point where I still, I don't know what I was doing in the beginning. I was like, what was that? Who is that person riding that bike, you know? One of my last two sessions, I was out there and, you know, I was in B group and uh, I was right, running laps, you know, I was one of the first two people, you know, that they allow, you know, move forward. And, uh, I started, I started going, you know, I'm running, I ran a lap, realized, okay, and I ran another lap, realized, okay, I'm still alone, up here alone, okay, <laughs> all by myself, you know, and uh, so by my third lap, I was turning on, I was at turn 19, making that turn, I looked back, and I realized, like, dang, they're still back there, you know, they have not caught up to me, and, and I expected them to, you know, and they had, and I had a couple people pass me in the, the last two sessions, and uh, eventually, I actually, and it, they actually, uh, I saw the tower, there's, you know, this little tower at the end of the track right where the starting line is. And I look up, and I see them, you know, jumping up and down, like, you know, that's it, look at him, look at him go, you know. And I was like, damn, I have that kind of support. I mean, now I'm addicted. <laughs> now I'm going back back up this Sunday. I don't have any money in my account, like $300 in my account, but I'm going to make it happen regardless. Because I'm hungry, you know. I had the best time of my life, and I don't want to do nothing else, you know. All in all, uh, Button Willow Raceway. The track itself, it's really bumpy, you know what I mean, it's it's really, really bumpy, but I don't care, but it's a great track, I, I'm satisfied, you know, like I said, I'm going right back to Button Willow on Sunday, I'm about to drive four hours, spend all my money, just go up there, I don't know how I'm going to eat next week, but I'm going to do what I got to do, you know, I mean, if you want something, should take it, you know, and I'm trying to see if I can get something for you guys next time, I mean, I actually track riding video, I couldn't this time because of a battery issue, it's a mess, but you know, I'm on a budget, so what can I do, you know what I mean, but hope you guys enjoyed, you guys will definitely see a lot more videos from me, and you guys will see a lot of updates, and I also got some pictures up, uh, I'm about to spend, you know, a bunch of money on the pictures right now, you know, hope you guys will be able to get that as well, okay, um, this is Jeremy with Inline Performance Magazine, and y'all have a great rest of y'all week, see you guys later.